All right, so we're going to be painting a uh, Bulldog Pro Line body today. Done uh, a few bodies so far, uh, familiar with the process. So I figured I'd uh, go through it with you guys. So in here we're going to have a book with some advertising, and we do have uh, the masks for the uh, windows and uh, some uh, like a decal sheet. That's uh, the body there. We have a protective film on the outside that we're going to leave. Put the masks on the windows. Okay, and I figured I'd throw these decals in. Wasn't uh, not decals, sorry, just a mask for the inside. It's not going to be a drastic change. I want to do a light color, uh, but uh, this will help me achieve that. So put them on as desired. That wasn't a full uh, mask sheet. I cut it myself to look the way I wanted. And that's uh, what I came out with here. So I sprayed my first uh, dark Daytona yellow. Start pulling off the mask. And you can see there. And uh, the color that I'm going to be putting back on actually quite looks quite uh, close to the uh, the mask color itself, but a little bit lighter. I want it to look like that, so uh, you can barely see it in the paint itself, almost like a gas color in the water. Okay, and here just pre-score the lines that comes out uh, relatively clean, but uh, what uh, what you can do afterwards is uh, just sand it off real quick. But it's the easiest way to get around it. I find even trying to cut around that material gets uh, quite cumbersome with the material back into the scissors. It's it's hard to get around. So if you just tear it off like that and go back over, do it once over with the scissors and if need be, sand it down. And take off the window mask. It's always good to trace over your mask itself just to make sure that uh, none of the paint uh, comes off. As you can see, the mask there uh, pulled off a little bit of the paint. There we go. And the final one there. And once that's done, you can just uh, pull off the, the film. It gives it a more of a shine after it's done. You can really see the colors come through. And we're going to put it on the D8 buggy, and that's what we're looking at now.